I'm here at the MSPO uh, Defence Show with uh, Anthony Walton from the Thales Australia. I'm standing close to the Hockey armored vehicle designed for the one of the specific Polish program we just discussed. So, Tony, tell us more about the vehicle. Tony Walton, I'm the, the bid director from uh, from Talos Australia. It's uh, great to be here in Poland. I'm standing in front of the uh, the Hawkeye vehicle produced for the Australian Defence Force by Talos Australia. We currently have uh, 1,100 of these vehicles on order for Australia in four-door and two-door versions. And what you see here uh, is the four-door version uh, in left-hand drive as marketed within Europe. Uh, particularly, this is this is a vehicle that uh, is uh, 10.4 tons, uh, 7.4 tons uh, curb weight, so it has a payload of three tons, and we have it today configured uh, with a number of systems that are uh, dedicated to the Polish market. So, in particular, we have a ZM Tano remote weapons station, WB Electronics uh, phone net system, and uh, we also have uh, the Obra laser warner system on board. And you can also see uh, behind you the Radmore radar radios uh, that are. But I think the, all the, for the, all the equipment market. is uh, strictly designed for one of the Polish program, military programs. Could you tell us more? Absolutely. Well, this, this vehicle is really targeted at, uh, at a number of programs in Poland. So there is the HOMAR program and, and the Pegasus uh, programs. Pegasus being for obviously special forces, military police and the, uh, and the Polish army units. So it will be uh, artillery reconnaissance vehicle in this configuration you, you mentioned because the top of system to... to On board, uh, we have the phone net system and uh, in W and the WB Electronics uh, Topaz system already fitted to the vehicle as an example of what could be done under HOMA. Uh, could a vehicle maybe manufacturing Poland will be Polak selected it for, for our special Absolutely. So, so, so the vehicle here as we represented it, left hand drive, could certainly, uh, depending on the numbers that are made, can certainly be manufactured in Poland. So, so we have uh, proposed a comprehensive Polonization package uh, that we have discussed uh, with WB Electronics, uh, sorry with um, PGZ and uh, and we have proposed uh, the full manufacturer or an assembly of this uh, vehicle in Poland uh, depending on the numbers. Because the vehicle is very very easy to convert so, so some variants and some other version and very easy to uh, assembly as uh, I heard and so this is something like the additional armor to the vehicle. Could you show us how it's easy replace it? We have some unique features. Uh, we have a bolted hull construction, mm -hmm. so making the, the vehicle a lot easier to assemble, so uh, no welding required, or limited welding required. And we also have our applique armour, which, uh, as you can see here, is very easy to replace, including by soldiers in the field. Mm -hmm. So that is a uh, composite armour panel. can be replaced from battle damage or so easy a marketing guy can do it. Did you offer the vehicle as well to that other nation than the Poland and Australia? Yes, yeah, certainly. The, uh, this left-hand drive configuration is offered to a number of customers uh, within Europe. Mm -hmm. um, and we are certainly, we feel that there are lots of opportunities, not only to, uh, to produce the, the vehicle in Poland, but also to export the vehicle from Poland to uh, other countries within Europe. You mentioned those are a different version of the vehicle. Could you explain us how other variants of the Hokie vehicle are available? For the customer certainly what you see here is a uh, five seat four door version so we can have a, a four seat version again in the four door or we have actually a two door what we call a utility version mm -hmm. that you can put a number of different payloads on the back including uh, short range air defense systems or uh, or cargo or a number of other systems depending on the customer requirement we okay. even uh, have a, uh, a mortar variant as well that we have uh, have done the concept designs for Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>